Today we're being called out to a small commercial property where the system is running with super low pressure and we're being called in for a second opinion. Now, this filter did throw me off at first. I saw it and I was like, man, that's real dirty. Let's go take a look at the intake line. It's for sure sitting in the mud. That would explain why we're seeing all that dirt in there. Look at that suction line. We could see the screen, which means it isn't sitting in the mud. But that's not the only problem. Let me show you what I found at the pump. On the front of the pump, on the front of a lot of pumps, there's an arrow that shows you the direction of flow. On this pump, it's showing the direction of flow going counterclockwise, this way, towards the controller. Now, when I turn on the controller, and then I turn it back off again, this should be spinning towards me. And it's spinning that way. That means the pump is running in reverse. And if it wasn't bad enough that that's sitting in the mud, if that wasn't sitting in the mud, this spinning in reverse would also cause the system to run in low pressure because the impeller is running in the wrong direction. It's gonna pull some water, but it isn't gonna pull it like it's supposed to. How do we fix that? The first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna shut the power off. So there's no power here. Controller's off. There is no power to this little pump station now. What we're gonna do over here is we're going to take this middle wire and swap it with this wire on the right. Now with those wires switched, and I think you can tell because you can see I crossed them right there. And we're gonna go ahead and turn on the power, wait for the controller to power up. We're gonna hit start and then we're gonna hit stop. And I could already see it's spinning towards me. So that means it is spinning in the direction that the arrow is telling it to spin towards me. So now we're spinning in the right direction. Let's see what happens just for a second now with that filter as we run it with full power. Well, we're now getting 45 PSI and before we were getting only 20 PSI. So we're definitely getting the pressure we want, but that motor is working really freaking hard. And that's because the end of the suction line is definitely in the mud. So we'll have to advise the client to get that out of the mud somehow. We'll find a way to do it, but the uh, pump running in the back. Oh my God, look at how dirty that filter got. Oh, jeez. All right, I should probably not do stuff like that with this open. So let's shut it down. Now that we're spinning in the right direction, we'll put all this back together.